there, Ultimate Yoshi here! Welcome back to more Let's Play Spyro Year of the Dragon! In the last episode, we did Desert, and in this episode, Haunted Tomb. Sounds like fun! If you know what I mean. Mm. I'm a waggle. Yes. Mm -hmm. Hello. Ah! Yet Dan. another daredevil adventurer has come to rob our catacombs of loot! Let's just hope you're made of tougher stuff than the last guy. If you can survive the trials of our catacombs and answer my riddle, we will give you a prize befitting your efforts. Here is my riddle. I am a vessel without hinges, lock or lid. Yet within my walls, a golden treasure is hid. What am I? Hmm. I'm too lazy to think. I'm sure the answer is somewhere in the level. Yeah. Hello, mummy. Are you my mummy? Alright. What's this? Oh, hi. Oh. I didn't... Okay. Stuff is kind of happening. Oh, for a second there, I thought that was an Earth Shaper. It's got, like, the same body. And they throw explodey stuff. Oh my god! It is an Earth Shaper! This is an Earth Shaper, and I can't hit him! I can't breathe fire, I can't... Can I, like, knock this down? No. Oh, j Ow! Stupid jackal. This is a level. I feel like I should be able to do something about those guys, but... Ow. Damn it. I keep thinking I can breathe fire on them because that's how you defeated the wolves in Spyro 1! Which I played over... Almost a year ago. Yeah! Oh my god, asteroids. These are not asteroids, but whatever. Just accept it and move on. And we can all be happier. Alright, I'll have to come back and kill those guys. You know, they always kind of like make it deceptively cha challenging or long because they like always have a ton of gems in these later levels, but in reality, they just give you a bunch of 25 first. And stuff like that. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, I bet I use these to kill them! That is right! Oh, I'm supposed to go over there. Okay. Well, I'll do that as soon as I kill this guy. Hello. Bam. Right in the crotch. That's gotta leave a mark. Well, it really didn't because he kind of exploded. And it exploded. I wonder how many people are going to get that reference. Probably not very many. I don't know why I pressed the L... the R2 button, but I did. Whoop. Boom. I kind of like that you have to use their own ammunition against them. And I also like how I figured it out. I like figuring things out. It's fun. Whack. Why do they have shepherd's cane? All right, tackle these guys. Why do the jackals just explode? I don't get that. Oh well. Well, that's a door. Yeah. These guys make funny noises. 
Ow. Let me in. Okay. Sorry if I'm not talking. It's... I don't know. I feel like I'm running out of things to say. Stuff is happening, and there are places and rocks. And this reminds me of Coco Mountain. Probably because there's a bunch of falling rocks that impede my progress and cause me to skirt around them right next to dangerous cliffs. Also, it's Choco Mountain, not Coco Mountain. How could I ever make such a big mistake? Are, is there like an Earth Shaper wannabe somewhere? Or what? Because like, just a bunch of those little tiny things are just showing up. Oop! Blah! Blah! I said. Hold on before I do anything. Kill the thing! Die. Hello, Jackal! Christine! She's crying. And she sounds like a boy. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Bleh. I like saying bleh. Ow! What the? Bleh! Bleh, 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 that was English. Okay. Where is the... Switch. No, seriously, where's the switch? Oh. This is the switch, okay. Oh god, there's falling boulders. I'm also kind of reminded of Pikmin. No, the multiplayer. Da! Nice. Throw me a bone, come on. Throw me in. Thank you. What even is this? You know what? Just die. I'm not sure why I bothered hitting that thing because I'm gonna be getting all this. Yeah, see, look at all the 25 furs you just get in these levels. There's a million. A million. Mono funnel, 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 John Bull! Blum, 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 blee, blee, blah. Anyways, one thing I think I should mention. about this Let's Play, is that I'm trying to get it just to be like a January Let's Play. I want this Let's Play to solely be a January thing. And not so much a February sneaker into her. Meaning that I've got a couple more levels left, and this is the 29th video. And there's still two more videos the I need to add The first round left. of the annual Demolition Hovercraft competition is about to begin. There is room for one more contestant, but you'll have to answer a riddle to qualify. The riddle is this. If one dragon can lay one egg in 12 years, how long would it take for 100 dragons to lay 100 eggs? I was tempted to do... I forget, like... 100 dragons to lay 100 eggs is gonna be the same as one dragon for one egg. Did he, did he, did he say that I was just one year? Okay, let me just make sure... I misread the information here. One, dra one, la one egg in 12 years, okay. So it's gonna be 12 years. Okay, I just didn't. My only, I understood what the what the trick was to the riddle, but I didn't remember the information. Anyways, L1 R1 dodge left right lob straight shot. Oh god. Okay. 
Oh, well, you can't float. Well, where's the last one? Oh! He's right there, and I didn't see him. Okay, so as I was saying, I want this Let's Play to be just a January thing. And so what does that mean for this? Basically, it just means... That I'm gonna be trying to make this jet video a little bit longer so that I can get potentially more done and thus um, I can get it done before the end of January. Alright, so there's gonna be a second version of this undoubtedly. MJ! He's doing juggling! Do you perform for birthday parties? You may now enter the championship round! Yay! Seeing the dangerous sport. No. Bring it on. I'm just kind of skipping past this dialogue because stuff. Ten of them, okay. Well. This reminds me of that Mario Party minigame. Which I only know because of Runaway Guys, I've never actually played Mario Party than 64 ones. Ow. Oh, damn it, I was low on sparks. I don't like the lob shots. Gotcha! Yeah! Took a little bit of time, I might speed that last one up, in fact I probably will, it took a little bit of time, but like, yeah, that wasn't a bad game, I don't, I don't really think it's like, badly designed, I don't know. Oh, TJ. MJ TJ. I don't know how to feel because, I guess I just personally consider that an unfair, like, type thing, but at the same time, I have no idea how they would fix something like that, so it's like, I don't even want to say it's a justified complaint, it's just, I don't know. I'm... Nah. Feel free to hate on me. I hate on me all the time. It's just... I don't even know how to explain it. I will admit, though, that when I did it well, it was fun. God damn it. Now I'm just gonna die to these stupid mummies. Alright, so let's continue on. And now I have an Agent 9 min mission. Really frickiant. 
Well, we have a path up here, so... Oh my god, this is another slide. I did not see this coming. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. I would have tried to save something first if I knew this was coming. Oh gosh, it didn't we do. Malcolm, you're in the middle of the level. Did I miss a gem directly over there? It doesn't look like it. Alright, bring me to safety. I'll take quote-unquote asteroids over suddenly slide. The worst part about that was I was not expecting it to happen. I mean, I wasn't expecting the other slide to happen, but at least well, that was in its own portal. And gave me time to get used to it, and I was just like, Oh, hey, another path. I wonder what's down here. Suddenly slide! <laughs> Luckily, I made it past. And I'm pretty certain I got all the eggs that were in it. So, that's good. Do these just open all the doors? Is that how that works? Like, they're not specific to a single door, but they work for all of them? I don't know. Anyways, let's go get the end of the level that's right next to Agent 9. I see you've managed to survive the trials of the catacombs. Now, let's find out if your wits are as quick as your feet. Do you remember the riddle? I am a vessel without hinges, lock or lid. Yet, within my walls, a golden treasure is hid. What am I? A bandicoot? I'm gonna guess an egg. Hmm... Have you heard that one before? Hmm. Will... They love I've reading waited 7,000 years for someone to solve that riddle. Now, I can finally head off to Seashell Shore to bury some bones. Okay, that's the thing. Alright, bring it on, monkey. What do you got for me this time? One of those dogs with funny hats put a curse on me just because I shot him in the butt a couple of times. <laughs> <laughs> he said he turned my tail into a snake. Does it look like a snake to you? It does feel kind of funny. Come to think of it, oh boy, the dog's gonna pay. It's not a snake. Behind this door lie the five deadly trials of King Rover. No one has ever survived all five. In fact, it is so dangerous that I cannot let you through this first door unless you are able to solve my riddle. Here's the riddle. I All follow you wherever you go. But the more of me you take, the more you leave behind. Okay, this is a riddle I've definitely heard before, but I don't remember the answer. Probably time. I'm sorry. No. It sounded like a good answer. Whatever, let's just skip. Uh, it's not Shadow, because I accidentally clicked that. Um, footsteps, probably. Okay. Whatever. I really wasn't trying to think about that. Admittedly. I can't move. I'm just gonna... Okay, so they don't have, like... I'm just accidentally ricocheting shots to kill them. I just kind of did that. On accident. Oh, was this just gonna be like there's a bajillion of them, or do I need to shoot pots or something? I'm just gonna try and ricochet shots to kill them because that seems to be a good solution when and it doesn't put me right in my line of sight. Or I could do stuff like that. This isn't that bad. Really, the only thing I didn't like about Agent 9 was when I had to do the stupid bomb throwing. Didn't like the bomb throwing at all. Ow. At least it's not insta-kill. Thank god for small figures. Oh, hey, an ex not an extra life, but... An extra hit. Ow. 
I love just re accidentally killing guys by by a shot ricochet. It's like I see a guy coming up and then suddenly he's dead by a shot that I didn't even intend to kill him with. Eat it. So many reused animations. Alright, let's try and find the last bit of gems that I'm missing. Apparently it's right over here. Did I kill this mummy? It's saying it's right over here. It's literally pointing me right into this. Go that way, points me over there. Go this way, points me here. It's literally right here, but... What the heck? I'm... Um... I can't get behind it. It's pointing me right to the casket. What the heck? How many other gems am I missing? Okay, I'm missing more than just that. Presumably, but like, it's so weird. Pointing me over there. Can you destroy these somehow? You must be able to because it keeps pointing me to them. But you can't charge them? You can't flame them? They're what I'm- they're clearly what I'm missing here. But you can't knock them down or anything. They may need to hit- hit a guy right into the red- part? I didn't seem to do anything. Let me try it again. Well, he just kind of rebounded. I don't know what to do. Maybe if there was like one of the Earth Shaper-esque guys still around, I could use one of their things to kill the caskets, but I also don't see why they would design something like that where you... Oh, wait. Let's test it out. If this is a solution, this is gonna be really annoying, but... God damn it. <sighs> BRB. 
Ага. Ты дам дам. Не. 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 There we go. Okay, well that was kind of annoying, but... I don't know. I really wouldn't think to do that, but luckily I had sparks there to help me out and figure that I need to break them. So, yeah. Woo, that's a bit dangerously close. Alright, so, um... If I take a look, this is not where I want to be. But if I take a look now... At the Atlas... Sorceress's Lair is the last thing that I have. And hopefully I can actually do the Bugbot Factory with Sparks before that. So I'm gonna go see if I can do that now. It's right over here. Okay, so I need to beat the Sorceress first, and that's the only- that's literally the only thing I have left. I guess that's gonna be in the Sorceress episode? Uh, like, that makes no sense. You get bonuses for these. Why would you want a bonus after you've beaten the game? I don't know. I just got an extra life. Alright, um... I guess next time on Let's Play Spyro Year of the Dragon, we'll be entering the doors. See you guys then.